good morning today is the day we are going to blind channel i got to sleep in a bit it's like just before 11. the goal is to go to the house at 12 to run some errands and uh get some last minute groceries that are like stuff that i want to get like day of and some lunch um so i'm gonna try to get pretty much everything done before we go i guess i could turn on some lights let there be light um and one of the things that i'm doing which is like completely unnecessary to do but I'm doing anyways, is making a Cricut project. Here it is. Um, my friend, even though he looks nothing like our boss, gets constantly confused for our boss. So I'm making a thing that says not our boss's name. Um, Cause I had a spare t-shirt that I think will fit him. So that's what we're doing. Again, fully unnecessary, but fun. And then once I get that done, I'll put the Cricut back away, make the bed and then use the bed as my staging area. I really think I just have that left and I've tossed like a bunch of my charges in there so I think we're doing okay. Alrighty, I have done all the things I need to on my computer and so we're unplugging things. So I, I have I have my mic stand or my mic boom packed but like part of me is like maybe I should oh where'd that go? Uh oh oh there it is. Part of me is like maybe I should also Stop dropping things that are important. Take three. Part of me is also like, <clears throat> I should bring this stand just in case I need it. Cause you never know, right? Um, so, I don't know. My allergies are super bad today. Not a fan of it. That's not the side that goes in. I am just, this is, this is difficult. This is very difficult. Um, maybe that was the side it went in. Whatever, anyways. Um, cause it doesn't take up a lot of space and just in case for some reason my mic boom doesn't attach to the desk, then we'll be good. Okay. Microphone, stand, headphones. I could unplug this, but I think I feel happier with it being like that. And then next we got to take this down. So we got that on there and we close the lens. We unplug that. We unplug that, um, and this I cannot do with one hand. I guess you, I guess you can kind of see what I'm doing. Um, so step one is releasing the plate. This is so dusty. Camera detached. Step two, I want to get that USB cable because that one is a very specific one, and if I lose it. I can't connect my camera. And then I'm also gonna take this part. Um, just cause it'll give me a little bit more flexibility, perhaps. Not really sure what the game plan is for the camera, if we're being honest. Because the desk doesn't isn't away from a wall, like it's built into the wall. So, um, so um, um, I'm bringing my man Frodo tripod and I'm gonna try stack it on something to make it work. Okay, we have camera power supply, continuous, very important. I mean, this camera does no, does not work off the computer anymore and even on the computer it's starting to lag, which makes me very sad because I'll have to replace the base and that's like thousand dollars. And now I'm gonna turn, oh, I guess I can unplug those guys. And I'm gonna turn this off, bye you. And then the microphone cable. Get that here somehow. Hello? Okay, we'll get that in a minute. <laughs> Unplug the last of the things. Come on. These like USB slots don't love to come unplugged. I mean HDMI. I actually remember having an issue with that one. Let me just unplug that. Oh, I guess I wanna take off my stick it notes. Oh. That got the DVI port. Look how sad this is. 
so sad. Okay, so the plan is to saran wrap this thing just to keep more dust out. It's very dusty. Um, and then, or oh, right, I want to get this cord. Oh, interesting. It's stuck. It's stuck in a really weird spot. There we go. All right. I think that's the last of the cords. So I think for the most part, I'm gonna stick the rest of the stuff in my backpack here. Um, but now I think I'm gonna get ready to head out, do the last bit running around. I just have like two or three things to get, a couple errands to run, and then, whoops, that was already off. And then it's like go time. So yeah, I'm feeling pretty confident. <laughs> Nothing's changed downstairs. So it's really just been this that I've been slowly stuffing things into. So I think I can easily get my microphone, my headphones, and my camera in here. I think. I think, I think, I think. And then I'm just gonna baby that the whole way. It's gonna be in my lap, I think. <laughs> okay, home from running errands. Um, time to pack up the last of this. And I realized that when I pulled out my uh, tower, I didn't grab the power cable, which is, I would say, rather important. So I have this now. I'm gonna unplug everything from the wall here. Um, one, because I like to do it, and two, because I want this. Oh my goodness. The cable management, which was questionable anyways, is now real bad. It is also super dusty in here. Okay, so we have these things here, and these things, and these things, and then I gotta wrap that. It's like quarter to two right now. My cousin's gonna get here around two-ish. I just touched base with her. And then we're leaving here at 2.15. And I gotta do my food too. <sighs> it's fine, also I gotta be. <sighs> I've been on the road, I've been doing shows. Now we ain't steak, remember sleeping on the floor. We're still in at the gas station when the time was cold. In the kitchen, hot still trying to flip it off the stove. Rocking fake J's, praying that nobody know. Watch him take my dog away, it was way too hard to stay composed. Fight to see the light of day, all this blood on my clothes. I was tired every day, green light, it's time to go. I don't wanna live life fast or die too young. Die too young. 100 miles per hour, I might crash, cause a good die young. Yeah, a good die young. Okay, we are almost packed. Got stuff in the back. Boss didn't unlock the actual truck, so we got this in this still. I'm dying. Cause I know my people needed me Diamond in the rough I don't know what it is They see me Go down as a legend In my city Cause we be the streets Trying to spread the wealth Around the block No I can't keep I think I'm dying I, I, And I really go pee But anyways We're here Alrighty So I've cooled down a little bit Um <laughs> from previously, I managed to go pee. I went to the store, talked to my boss for a bit, did a little bit of work. Um, and now we're starting to like set things up. I think the goal for tonight is gonna be probably the Starlink, um, but we'll, we'll see. I'm currently trying to pull out my monitors here and probably empty this thing as best as I can. And then obviously, I think all the cables for the monitors are in there and like the pa and in here is, is bad, is bad. But this is gonna be the setup. The fridge is to hold this. But also it's on, so I, if I want, like I can keep the drinks and stuff in there. And I'm actually thinking I need to shuffle it over a bit because I need to get my mic stand on the side. <sighs> but there's not much space, like, <laughs> there's not much space for the monitors. But we'll make do. I'll probably put one at an angle here and then one in front. That's probably the solution. Alrighty, I have my computer like fully set up mostly. It's connected to the blind channel internet. We're gonna do Starlink either later tonight or tomorrow, but I'm gonna go down to the Share Bear and visit for a bit and also see if my coworker will, or his wife will come and help me in the store tomorrow because we have so much to do. <laughs> it's gonna, it's, and then, you know, at some point. <laughs> that is the most cricket tripod in the world. Is that any better? I think it's a little better. Anyways, hello, it is basically nine o'clock. I am trying to get organized and unpack. So I've got like all my toiletries here. 
um, which I'm going to pull out the things that I need. I don't actually need toothpaste. I have extra toothpaste. Allergy meds. Saccharis. <laughs> anti anti itch cream because bug bites. I have like a a thing so I won't get bug bites, but they still come. <laughs> they love me. Um, and then I'm gonna put everything in this tote box, which is my toothpaste, which is like my uh, extra stuff. Allergy medicine and throat lozenges. I was having like a hard time finding allergy medicine, but I think I should be good now because I have two, four, six. Um, I think that should be okay. Got my green hair dye for when I need it. And we're gonna zip this up and put this right in the tote. So everything's all organized. We love to see it. Maybe we'll turn it. Will it fit this way? Everything's falling down. Perfect, there we go. Uh, I think this one has more toiletries in it. Uh, makeup. Uh, yes, but I feel like it's stuff I don't need to worry too much about right now. I ain't gonna be putting on makeup tonight, that's for sure. Um, so I'm gonna just stick this and my makeup. And I think I, where are my brushes? Brushes. We'll stick that on there, stick it back up top. Oh, that got heavy. This, oh, <laughs> I didn't realize I brought some of these because I definitely uh, brought some in, but this is mostly just my decor for the room, which we will get to eventually. Got my 3M things, whatnot. I think we'll leave this as is. Maybe put the exercise bands that I brought and we'll probably never use in here as well. Uh, I think I can put hats up here. I think maybe I went overkill on, on the throat lozenges. It's just because like with streaming and stuff, my throat gets a little dry sometimes. But you know, we won't run out, one would assume. <laughs> Got some random tech stuff in there. I need to unpack my clothes, but I think I'm actually gonna do the Starlink here because I would like to have good internet. <laughs> Is it too much to ask when you spend $1,000 on a satellite? No. <laughs> I definitely am gonna have to deal with these clothes <laughs> before I go to bed, um, but we got some hangers. I brought some in and then I still had some left over. It looks like I pilfered pretty good earlier uh, a couple months ago. And then this is just like my random stuff. Uh, the two guys that are living in this house are moving out. So I think I'm just gonna hide that in one of the spare rooms. That's the plan. But you know, we're, we're getting there. This almost looks like a decent setup. I have to, angles aren't quite right there, but I think we'll figure it out. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with my camera, but I don't know, we'll get there. Now on to the fun stuff, Starlink. So it's a big box. It's a big boy. We got a screwdriver, which is basically as good as a, a knife, right? Wrong. There we go. You know what? I just realized I have a knife because I keep a knife out here for work. Anyways, this works. Okay, let's look at this. Let's look at this baby together. All right, this feels like a... Uh, uh, moment if I've ever seen one. Look at this. Useless piece of paper is what that is. Okay, let's see. Ooh. Fancy. Okay, that's clearly the base for the satellite portion. In the satellite portion. Clearly I cannot do anything with that um, with one hand, so hold up. Alright, let's get this out of here. I'm assuming somewhere there are instructions. This smells good. You know, like that new smell? That's what this has. Oh, and another piece. Oh, here we go, here we go. This tells me what to do. I was wondering why that other piece of paper didn't have it. Okay, so we're just gonna, looks like it clips in, maybe? Oh, I see, like this. Vanna White. This is, the modem, so that's gonna go in my room, and I need to uh, maybe put a little hole in the in the screen. My boss knows. <laughs> this is 
is nice. It is a very long cable. Okay, but this is already attached here, which means I have to feed it from the outside, which is going to be a bit of a pain, but we'll figure it out. We're still a bit of a mess as we uh, unpack, but I figured right here would probably be the best place to put it. Look at this skookum cord. Oh, that was a satisfying push in um, because obviously my computer's right there. I don't have the ethernet adapter at this moment, um, but not opposed to getting it. I'm just working the cord around. We're still a mess. <laughs> okay, besides things like falling, this should be able to plug in right there, which is perfect. And then, like I said, I have this Netgear Nighthawk, which will give me Wi-Fi. If it doesn't work, I will order the internet adapter for the Starlink, but that is like another $40 purchase. So anyways, I guess I'm going to see what the hole in that screen looks like. I don't know if you can see there's duct tape there <laughs> and then try to uh, feed some things through. This might be difficult as a single person, but we'll try it. This thing's so much bigger than I thought it was. Anyways, I think I can. I think I can. I should close this window or this door. Okay, so now what we need to do is get this handy app. Actually, you know what? I probably need to plug it in. Hold. I like haven't plugged into the window or into the dish and I assume that's important. Did I say into the window? I meant into the wall. To the window. To the wall. <laughs> Okay, that's plugged in. This actually worked really well. I didn't actually have to cut a hole. There wasn't a hole in the screen, even though there was duct tape, but I didn't actually have to cut a hole, so. This is not working well, bye. This is the second time that's fell in the garbage. Oh, that one's actually empty, okay. Okay, this is plugged in now, as I was saying. Now, as I was saying, there is a startling cap Starlink, and uh, we're gonna try to figure this out. Don't know what I'm doing, but we'll figure it out. Visibility. Visibility? Oops. I'm gonna kill myself if I'm not careful. Okay, I need to connect to my, my network. I'm so confused. Oh, Starlink, there we go. Unsecure network? Okay, okay. The cat is just like uncertain about everything. Okay. Do you see that? Do you see that? Okay, that's probably not gonna be the place we leave it. <laughs> um. We're obviously gonna go with the best name ever, Pretty Fly, for some Wi-Fi. <laughs> Let me get a password. Starlink. Wait. Starlink, let me do the thing. Um, network. Sir. We'll get there. I think I need to move it further away. I think that's the problem. Take two. <laughs> we have the Starlink back down there. Um, can I just connect to the network? Where'd you go, bruh? What if we... <sighs> I think we've discussed putting it on, on, the, on the roof. There we go. We just haven't got there yet, obviously. Pretty fly for some Wi-Fi. Okay. Okay. I think, I think it worked. Oh my God. Mosquitoes, Starlink. 
I hear it moving. <laughs> why can't you join Starlink? Oh, because it's called Pretty Fly for some Wi-Fi now. That would be why. <laughs> it's trying to connect. It's no longer connected to the blind channel stuff. It's trying to connect. Okay, okay, promising. No internet connection. Okay, step one. I need to scan the sky. <laughs> okay, let's let's do this like a moron. I feel like an idiot. <laughs> okay. It's estimating obstructions currently. This might take a while. Processing. 2%. Oh, it's going pretty quick now. Look at it go. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, 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 okay. This is a great place for your Starlink. Awesome. Perfect. Okay. This is... Oh my god. I'm getting eaten alive. I need to go inside. Okay. So, it is still giving me the error that I'm not using it in my expected zone, expected location, which I don't know. So fortunately I'm on Wi-Fi with this beast. So we're gonna do some Googling um, and see if we can figure this out. I don't know. <laughs> Alrighty, I am very happy to report that I got the Starlink working basically. The issue was is because blind channels are remote, remote and stuff, the address that I put in to get the Starlink um, was like on a random highway. <laughs> So um, I just had to adjust my service area to blind channel and then it worked like a charm and it's going well. I've got five full bars. You know, let's do a speed test. Internet speed test. It's going to be sad because in town I'm like 800 up and or sorry, 800 down and like 80 up. Oh, wow. Better than I thought. Okay, so we're 118 down, which is impressive considering I thought it would be like under 100. And it looks like we're 20, oh, 21.7 up. That's better than anticipated. So anyways, I'm going to, that's so bright, be on my computer for a couple. And then I am going to um, unpack some clothes and find my bed so I can... Um, you know, function as a human <laughs> today, tonight, and then again tomorrow. I gotta be at the store at like quarter to nine. Should be fun. Alrighty, well, it is the end of the night now. It just hit 12 o'clock. It is time for me to go to bed, but I'm so happy. Like, I've got every. Wait, I'll show you. So, everything here is glued. My clothes are off there. Things are pretty organized. I have like a bunch of tech stuff that I need to deal with. And like I said, I'm gonna shirk that stuff into another room, but even if it stays there, it's not bad. Bed is made with my blanket and my pillow from home. I have like craft stuff in there. And then a bunch more clothes in here. This is a bit of a mess, but you know what? Not bad at all. I'm very excited. Um, but with that, oh, I'm stuck. <laughs> but with that, I'm going to say thanks so much for coming along on today's adventure. Make sure you hit that subscribe button because we're going to be out here doing summer resort stuff. Hopefully every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday this whole summer through the beginning of September. Um, I'm gonna go to sleep and I'll see you later. <laughs> Bye.